Hello everyone. Welcome to my second process video for the December 2020 She Lit of Cards sketch. Here again is a sketch. It's from Call Me Crafty Al, Alicia. I'm going to pick up where we left off. Unfortunately, I had misplaced a piece, so I had to cut another one. And time ran out before I was able to put it on. So we're going to start there. And I only have three, so that will give us time to start on the sentiments. I picked Christmas Wishes from the Heart. This is from the October 2017 Hero Arts Kit. And because this strip here is already uh, cherry cobbler, dark maroon color, I'm going to do the sentiment in Gordon Green. And I also opened up the ephemera pack and kind of looked around to see what would make some great uh, add-ons there instead of the sentiments. So we will work with that too. All right, so let's get started. We're gonna put these three pieces on first. 10 minutes on the clock. Using my Tombow Mono adhesive, liquid glue, and let's put that on this one. Not least. So, I'm going to go ahead and stamp all the sentiments because I could use them. For something else. And because this is this is the size that Alicia showed on her uh, supply list or her cutting guide. So I'm going to be doing this but it will leave me room for little embellishments. Okay. Garden green. Let me just stamp this off on something to see if it's going to work okay. Yes. I should have checked and maybe re-inked. So because this piece is going to go under here, I've got just a very little, not even an inch. So I'll put it like right in the middle.
have them stacked on top of each other because it just gives a little more cushion. I managed to squish this finger now. I just got over this one, and now this one's all squished, so it'll probably show up black too. I was putting my food processor away, and somehow my finger got stuck underneath. Okay, so there's these. They will go under here, like so. And then, like I said, there'll be room for embellishment under around. Or I could put one of the ephemera pieces on. Let's see which one would look best here. Still white on white against white though, isn't it? How about that one? Yeah. I think that looks cute. Alright, let's put this like right here because it's not really tall. That right there and then put this here you notice there's a little bit of a whoops on this one a punch probably would have been easier one of those border punches because I've never used the decorative scissors before and it doesn't go all the way because it's long. So there's a little bit of a bump where I stopped. Okay, there we go. There, how's that? Okay. Well, let's see. This one. Or we could just, that's, oh, yeah, that's fine. We'll put this one and then we'll add some embellishments to it. How's that? 
Is that cute? Put it down right about there. Getting all gluey fingers. It's not inky, it's gluey. There we go. How's that? Cute. And we will go with Christmas Wishes from the Heart. The sentiment strip goes under the decorative strip. Okay, we're done already. Well, that went fast. Sometimes it seems to go so slow and other times it seems to go so fast. Okay, so we have three completely ready for embellishments. You know how I am, we gotta decorate. And then of course I'm gonna put an insert in here, the, the craft card bases. We got one, two, four more, five, four and a half. <laughs> All right, stay tuned for our next time and I should get these done and embellished. I have plenty of uh, not Nouveau drops, but the enamel dots. I have enamel dots. I have ephemera. I have stickers. It's going to be fun. So please join me. And don't forget to like and subscribe. I will leave the show us your sheet load video, the showcase. And I will leave process number one video at the end of this one. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.